I like Camp Fasola for about a million reasons, but I like all the people that I get to meet and make friends from all over the world, really. And I like everything that I learn. Um, opportunities to learn about the history and explore composers that I probably wouldn't have the opportunity to do on my own. I think it's a great place, really lovely, great fellowship, really good food, really good singing, and the classes are very good. And it's pretty easy to get to if you have to fly in. It's very fun, very, meet a lot of new people, meet a lot of people from a lot of different backgrounds, a lot of good singing. I enjoy mostly learning the technical side of the musical, or the musical side, for more in depth. Though I enjoy learning the history mm -hmm. too. That was very fun. Um, classes where you're actually learning something about the mechanics of singing. That's been the best part to to get an explanation of something that's happening and then to do it and experience how it works. Like Rob's class on accent, that was really very helpful. Um, the, the teachers are really wonderful. Uh, the, the people that we're doing this with are just uh, uh, very serious-minded folks. And I think we're all very different, but it doesn't seem to prevent us from really uh, getting into this uh, and enjoying the music. So, so I think it just kind of opens you up and helps you want to learn more. It's come for the rudiments, for the really solid grounding in the basic elements of singing and singing together as a group. So it, it can really be just a, a, a tremendous experience to be pushing new people. It's been nice having the mixture of both uh, lessons where we can learn the nuances and how to do things. Um, from people who have really been in the tradition a long time. And I'm, I'm just as interested in the history of the families and the composers as I am in the actual singing. So, so this is ideal because we get everything here. Mm -hmm. yeah. This is my first time at adult camp. The accommodations are very nice here. Uh, I also really enjoy uh, Camp Lee, the youth camp. And uh, they're both, uh, both great, great times, a lot of good friendships. Um, very good way to spend a week of your summer to uh, improve your singing and uh, enjoy it very much. Especially if you if you want to become a, a better singer, uh, it's uh, in, been invaluable experience for me. Uh, I, I was learning a, a little bit by going to uh, monthly singings, but once I went to camp, especially the first time, it's my, my singing really took off uh, after that, and it's just it, you know continues to get better because of uh, camp, it's just, there, there's no, it's really, it's the best thing you can do. Raymond Hamrick actually told me uh, one time that there was nothing better I could do to uh, improve my singing than uh, to go to camp. So uh, that's, you can't get much better advice than that. Well, this is my second year. And last year when I decided to come, I didn't really know much about Sacred Heart. I had been to a couple singings and I had a book and I had listened to recordings and just kind of learn by myself. And so I decided I wanted to come to camp, but I was kind of scared to drive out here by myself, so I didn't know where it was. And I just shot out a message, and somebody answered it and drove me to camp. And I didn't know a soul when I got here, but I came away with tons of friends, and it's been really fun to come back this year and meet more people and see all the same people as last year. I'm really enjoying it. Um, I think people are really people are really friendly. The lessons are really interesting and informative and helpful. And you know, the heat's not that bad, so <laughs> it's pretty good. Pretty good. They can rest. They can listen to the birds. They can get wet when it rains. <laughs> it's a nice place. And, and very clean. Mm -hmm. Very friendly. Those people are just really nice people. The campus is so beautiful, it's swank. I went hiking around the, the other side of the, the hill today and it was beautiful. Um, and it seems, yeah, like everybody's really welcoming and, and lovely. I just, I think all of the, the whole community is just so diverse and everybody has such an incredible different thing to offer. No, it's been uh, fun to get to explore some of the, like, the backwoods up there. So went up and did a 
hike yesterday. I did not anticipate all the spider webs, but <laughs> sort of tried it again today once it had dried out, and it was just beautiful. And the food is wonderful. And of course, for me, when I'm out here, I'm driving on the different side of the road. So if I park the car and not have to drive for three whole days is absolutely wonderful. And just to be able to walk everywhere and not not to have to worry about logistics, just just concentrate on the learning. Mm -hmm. So it's ideal. Good. The accommodations are, are marvelous. I've, I've never been to uh, a conference or a, or a camp or, or anything where the food was, was this good. And certainly never anything called a camp that had uh, basically what are, amounts to motel suites that you can stay in, private bathrooms and everything. It's really, really nice. Uh, makes the experience, uh, makes it so that you can focus on, on what's going on rather than than fighting with tents and sleeping bags or something <laughs> like that, or, or bunk beds and snoring. Uh, I found a camp online looking for communities that could come join and get singing school real quick um, and get thrown into the, the trick, you know, right away. And um, I'm just so happy that I came because everybody has been incredibly welcoming. It's a diverse community, and I feel like the, the support of everybody trying to get me singing as quickly as I can, with having as much fun as I can, everybody's really communally together with it. And also that all the, the lessons and, and the talks that people are given, we, we sing in them too, and that's, that's really nice. It's not just talking, it's, it's uh, interactive. Um, and also that, you know, it's not just the teacher leading, we have uh, people themselves who are participating and they get to lead stuff as well. It provides a uh, good uh, atmosphere to, to learn and apply what we learn. I come because there's always more to learn, but it's, this is a family and this is kind of like a family reunion with classes. Um, I love being around people who have had this music in their lives all their life. I love being around new singers and trying to contribute something to them. I take pictures and that's, that brings me great joy because a lot of people react positively to me when they see the pictures. And uh, I don't know, this is, Sacred Harp has changed my life. I see that it's strengthened the community and I think it's strengthened the, the Alabama community. I think it's strengthening the future for Fasala in this state, and um, David said, you know, at that first camp in 2003, we're, ho we're just hoping to get it, get through three years, and here we are, 10th in an annual camp and talking about next year, so, yeah, <laughs> and not What's your favorite part? Singing. Eating. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. Girls. <laughs>